we'll start with opening our web browser. Go to the address bar and type our IP address. Type our system manager ID. System manager pin. Administrator login. And we'll go to settings registration. And under function settings on the left hand side here, we'll go to sin. And under common settings, we're going to go to network settings, email IFAC settings. And this is where we have our SMTP settings. First one we're going to look at here is the SMTP server. For Office 365, the server address is smtp.office365.com. And the email address, this will be the email address the copier uses to send out scans to, from email. And below that will be the SMTP TX port. Typically nowadays, this is port 587. It will depend on your SMTP server, which port it's using. Right below that, where I have the username and password for the SMTP server. This username is gonna be the same email address that we entered up here and the password for that email address. We're going to want to check use SMTP authentication if we have authentication for our server and allow TLS for SMTP TX. If you need to change your password, you can click the change box here and change your password. And then the other thing we really will change is under allow TLS SMTP RX, we are going to do, select the drop down and select on. When you make any of these changes, you'll want to come back up to the top, press OK. And then we'll want to go back into network settings, email IFAC settings. And you should see any changes that you made. And we'll use this box here, check SMTP connection to check the connection to the SMTP server. You get a pop up here. I think this may take some time. We'll hit OK. And you should get a message here. Our message was connection to the server was successful. If you get an error message, it'll generally give you some kind of idea of what, what was wrong, whether it was a password or username or some other um, issue causing it. It will pop up right here. And you said OK. Thank you.